Well, this morning, it is no secret that food deserts are a problem in the St. Louis region. Our community gardens that provide people with healthy and affordable foods, though, they're getting a new life. Our Mercedes McKay is joining us live from downtown with this story. And Mercedes, how much money is actually going to go into these gardens? Running Michelle, it's pretty incredible. $50,000. That's how much money the Missouri Department of Agriculture is awarding nonprofits to address food insecurity. And grants were actually given to five groups here in the St. Louis area. All of this money will help drive down the cost of fruits and vegetables like asparagus and apples. One of those recipients is Midtown Community Services. The nonprofit serves close to 300 people a year in the St. Louis area. Everything that's grown at this community garden is given to local food pantries. Coordinator Dylan Naylor tells me it's hard to keep it blossoming on a minimal budget. But thanks to the Food Insecure Cost Share Grant, the extra dollars will cover 75% of their costs. This is going to buy us for um, the next growing season for like our seeds. Um, we're going to have to buy some like garlic to plant this fall. Um, we're going to get some compost. We're going to get some new hoses. Um, just the you know general supplies for for gardening. Let's talk about why groups like this are so vital for our community. This morning, about 15% of people in the bi-state face hunger. More than 50% of them have to choose between feeding their family or paying their utility bills. Those statistics really showing the need across our area. Now, the whole mission of this grant is to increase food production and availability. Other projects the money went to include community farmers markets, prep kitchens, and agricultural learning centers. And coming up in our next half hour, we'll dig more into what Midtown Community Services is doing right now in our community. Live in downtown St. Louis, Mercedes McKay, five on your side.